Good morning. So today I'm going to bring to you my fresh face everyday makeup. I did post a picture on my Instagram and Facebook and everybody wanted me to do a video. So I decided to do the video for you guys. So if I shower at night, doesn't matter. Um, I wash my face anyway. So I get up in the morning and I wash my face, brush my teeth. And then I go ahead and I apply my eye cream. And you guys know I use a La Curcio Skin Care. This eye cream right here. And I already had applied it. Because I wanted to, it to absorb in my eyes before I applied any makeup. Um, I go ahead and I go back with a Neutrogena makeup remover wipe. And just kind of clean up any excess or oils or anything that I might have. I feel that when I apply this on my face... Um, it actually gives me a smoother canvas to work with and then my face looks really nice and put. After I've done all that, I go ahead and apply a primer. I usually use my pore professionals, but I think Junior got into my stuff. But I'm going to be using this Lorac Perfection Modifying Face Primer. And it's a little sample. I don't remember where I got it. I don't know if they sent it to me when I bought my Urban Decay palette or my Lorac palette. I don't remember. I It's a sample though, so I have no idea. I don't remember. But I'm going to go ahead and apply some of that to my face. And I'm just going to rub that into my skin where, where I mostly need it. And I'm just going to massage that into the skin. Let it sit for a little while. Then I go ahead with my foundation. And the foundation that I use is the Studio Fix in NC35. I actually am almost done with it. Well, actually I am done with it. I'm actually using the last. So I have it upside down since last night. So... All the product can come down for me to use it. I'm going to go buy me a new one because it's not pretty anymore. So I'm going to go ahead and hopefully I can get some out. I'm going to go ahead and put some on my hands. I'm going to go ahead and apply our foundation. And I'm going to be using my Sedona Lace FB I think 07. Since I've been using it a lot, the numbers are starting to erase. So I'm going to use this beautiful brush that I love so much. I go ahead and use my MAC Fix Plus. And I'm going to spray my brush. I love the smell. So I'm going to use the brush wet. I don't want to use it dry because I feel like it absorbs the whole foundation. And I get not so much on my face. Prep and Prime from MAC and this is a light boost and I just use this to kind of brighten up my eyes a little bit since I'm not going to be doing any um, eyeshadow or anything like that because like I said if I'm in a run to go somewhere I want to look awake I don't want to look like I took forever to get fixed up so I just go ahead and highlight That, I go ahead and I grab my Sedona Lace 773 brush and it looks like this and I go ahead and spray it with some setting spray
highlight that I applied, I go ahead with my Ben Nye Banana Powder and I set it with my Sedona Lace 217 brush. the rest of my face I go ahead with my Mac Studio in NC35 and my Pretty Girls brush. So this is supposed to be an everyday look. I just like to do my brows at least if i'm not going to do the whole face i'm going to be doing my brows i have to do my brows so i'm going to be using my angled brush and my dip brow pomade and auburn the most dramatic of my whole face is my brows my brows have to be done so from there I'm gonna go with warm soul and my Soliva Lux highlight and I like to use this uh, brush as a contouring brush but since I'm not going for that dramatic contour so I'm going with warm soul soul sorry and it looks like this <laughs> I'm going to go ahead and apply MAC Peaches with the same brush. Go ahead and I'm going to be using Sushi Kiss. And this is what it looks like. It's an orangey. I know it looks really bright maybe on camera. But once you apply it on your lips, it doesn't look too dramatic. apply some mascara and this mascara I was sent to me when I bought my shoes the year samples and I really like this mascara for the bottom lash line so I'm just gonna go ahead and apply some mascara to the bottom lash line enjoyed this video i want to thank you guys again so much for watching and subscribing i am almost there to the 100,000 subscribers oh my god i can't believe it i am so excited i want to thank you guys all so much to my new and old subscribers it means the world to me that you guys are watching my videos and subscribing and yeah so stay tuned for more videos and i really hope you guys enjoyed this look so stay tuned and we'll see you guys again in my next video bye